What's up guys, Zach Scott here playing Thomas Was Alone. The initial group possessed simple variations in size and strength. More complex configurations were inevitable. As the error spread, these variations became increasingly extreme. I said it! I was able to read one! What's a new? This was how Claire would die. Oh. She knew it would happen eventually. No, I don't... I don't want to die. She's rubbish at jumping. And she moved slowly. She felt a little like... Her continued existence was breaking some kind of natural order. Uh -oh. The crumbling pillar was a dramatic death, she supposed. Wait, what? Claire couldn't shake the feeling that she was not, in fact, dead. It was at that moment that Claire realized she had superpowers. <laughs> oh wow! So Claire can float. She would need a cape. There was no getting around that. You couldn't be a superhero without a cape. <laughs> Claire didn't want confusion. <laughs> if you saw a cape, that made matters clear. You knew what you were dealing with. Claire was all about communication. And, you know, floating in water, which was her superpower. All right, so we got Claire, who looks to be just as tall as John. And Claire is rubbish at jumping. Oh, she can't even get up here, but she has a superpower. I love this game so far. I really do, this has been great. Oh, I can't even, oh my God, I see what I gotta do. Maybe. I bet John has to carry Claire. Oh, wait, there we go. Nice. Um, well, even if she falls in, it'll be okay, right? Unless she has to go down here, which she can't, because she can't fit. Oh, oh well. Don't worry about the water then. John's got it. Oh, bummer. Don't worry. John doesn't care. Can you make a long jump? Oh, he almost can, actually. I bet I can make that in one jump. So far, this game has been ridiculously fun. Uh, just so you guys know. <laughs> I am enjoying it. Uh, this... I, I like... I mean, the, the narration adds so much to it, obviously. Sorry, I'll move. I just thought I would just talk for a bit. The uh, I'll get it. Don't worry. John will make it. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. John dissolved in the water. He's no superhero. I mean, he can leap tall bounds, but, you know... Oh, I thought it was going to make it. Okay, I'll have to just use some precision. Or maybe, you know, Claire could help. But she doesn't need to, because John made it. Boop. Oh, wow. Are they all going to be... Right. Fear not, my skinny friends, for I am Claire, and I will save you. <laughs> Claire needed to come up with a superhero name as soon as possible. Claire was rubbish. Oh, what? No. Don't worry, she's got this. Nice. Can John just carry them all? There we go. There we go. Here goes Thomas. Here goes Chris. And of course, John. Right here. Claire just needs to do her part. Not that she hasn't helped already. Here we go. It's raining. Claire arrived just in time. Which was, of course, the perfect moment for superheroes to arrive. <laughs> so true. Looks like Thomas has got some stuff to do here. Like hitting switches. Nice. Good job. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. All right. All right, I think I got the hang of this level. Maybe. Hopefully nothing bad happens. As the water began to rise, Claire vowed to save this little rectangle in as many restarts as it took. <laughs> so noble. Oh, God. Oh, no. I wondered if Thomas would make a good sidekick. Yes. Was she more the lone Avenger type? She'd like that. 
the sole hero in a world of rectangles and conveniently placed pools of toxic water. Thomas will be the sidekick. He doesn't mind. All right. All right, we got Chris, John, and Claire. Uh, Claire cannot even jump. All right, here we go. I bet that's a good place for... There we go. Of course, Chris needs to get over there too. John has like no problems ever. The others told Claire that staircases were a bit of a fixture here. Claire wondered why the world made it so difficult. So that we could work together. I don't know if that's the real reason or not, I'm just guessing. Thomas isn't so alone anymore, was he? Of course, the title is Thomas was alone. He started out alone, now he's not. Or maybe it's just foreshadowing the death of all of Thomas's new friends. That's my guess. All right, I think I'm gonna send John to explore. Checkpoint. All right. All right, it looks safe. There we go, he's done. Now Claire will probably have to help John cross the water, maybe. John is very eager. <laughs> there we go. Completed. Claire probably needed a nemesis. A villain who would show their true colors at the worst possible moment. Hurting all she held dear. <laughs> Please, no. Chris was the most obvious choice. <laughs> he seemed stroppy enough, and his jump was so pathetic that it conveniently avoided Claire's insecurities. Yes, Chris. Diabolical Chris. The fiendish Christopher. I think Chris is going to have to be her sidekick right here. Maybe, let's see what happens. Ugh. It's like sure death for... Oh, you know what? I bet she doesn't need a sidekick. That's right. She's got this on her own. Nicely done. fell off right there what do you guys think about this game so far I think it's pretty cool just a matter of moving blocks the right way I think I got this the stage at least what if you get extra points for making it as centered as possible probably not Two point seven. Wait, where had Chris gone? Was he off somewhere, plotting Claire's downfall? Most likely. If Claire was honest, and she had to be because she was a superhero, <laughs> this was a troubling turn of events. Still, there were reasonably sized bodies of water to cross. She's got this. Superhero Claire. How do you guys like the thumbnail that I came up with for this series? <laughs> it's fairly straightforward, as you can see. All right, let's... Uh... Oh 
dear. Who should I sh I'll send John. John will figure this out. Claire goes there. John and the red dude go there. Thomas. Sh I should use their names. Here we go. Man, I love... I mean, this game... This game is fairly, you know, straightforward, simple, excellent concept, but what really makes it is the story and the voiceover and the personality injected into these blocks. And, uh... That's what really want. I guess, you know, just seeing a trailer made me want to play this game. Two point eight. Moving platforms over water, eh? Claire's newly heightened senses told her that there were multiple paths across with various possible configurations of the little posse. Hmm. I wonder what she needs. They were doing really well. Claire hoped she could get them all across. John was fully aware he could do this alone. <laughs> Thomas hoped he'd never have to. Oh. <laughs> There you go, Claire. Oh, but they can't get to the end without each other. Oh dear. Oh, that was a close. I, Thomas was almost a goner there. Uh, uh. Let's let Thomas go first. And here's John. Two, nine. Oh, spikes. Jeez. Is Claire by herself now? Seems like it. Watch out for those spikes. Claire was alone. Which was odd. Because she wasn't meant to be alone. She needed to be where there were rectangles to save. Being the only superhero in a given space kind of defeats the object. <laughs> Whoa! Spikes? That was new. Claire avoided them. She decided they were most likely her kryptonite. Not the rubbish red kryptonite either, the proper radioactive green stuff. Ah, but she could use the other side. Nicely done, Claire. Final jump probably nice here comes 210 same one with Thomas I guess repeat wow deja vu yeah what's the catch here the world was repeating and this time Thomas was here Claire felt something had gone wrong there was a disturbance in the force no, no, no. You need to help Thomas. Something had altered the matrix. Oh, come on. What the heck? The world was reacting to their progress. It was amassing its forces. It was plotting against them. Totally. <laughs> Claire finally had a nemesis. It's not me. I'm the helper. Oh, the, uh, these spikes might be quicker, actually. Now that I think about it. Hard to tell. Well, I believe this will be the last level that I play for today's video. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. Ah, thanks for every like and favorite that really helps out this video, this series, Thomas Was Alone. If you want to check out this game for yourself, go to thomaswasalone.com. It's really cheap. I don't know how much it is at the time of this recording, but uh, it was relatively, really cheap. Oh, Thomas needs to kind of back up a little bit. Like a lot. There you go, buddy. There we go. It's Claire's destiny right here. Whee! I didn't even look to see if he landed okay. I bet he did, though. And there we go.
Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye.